everyone this is deepka patel and welcome to the vedic mathematics class okay so let's start our today's class and let's see so in today's class we will be discuss all the methods and the calculations which we had learned in our previous video so this class will be based on your practice session okay so i am writing here some questions and we will be starting from the dashamsha sutra and then we move forward okay so i am writing here some question and you have to answer just immediately in your mind and just do not use the pen paper or finger and be true with yourselves and see your progress okay so let's start so you have the first question is dropping tens method okay 6 8 9 10 11 12 13 5 okay so you have to just answer the question okay next we have also from the dashamsha sutra so 89925438754 okay and next we will see the double digit addition so you have the question 48 plus 94 72 plus 81 73 plus 84 55 plus 67 77 plus 85 okay so let's see starting from the last let's count firstly so 5 6 11 so it will be it is increasing by it is it is more than the 10 so we will drop a line here or the dropping the tens okay so we have the remaining end number is 1 okay because we have the 11 after adding 5 and 6 okay so 1 plus 7 8 8 8 16 16 again drop a ten and we have 6 end number 6 5 11 11 again drop a ten we have m1 is the end number 1 9 10 11 again drop a ten we have 0 okay 0 plus 5 5 5 8 13 drop a ten And we have three end number seven three ten drop a ten we have zero zero plus zero 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 plus nine nine okay and nine plus eight seventeen drop a ten and we have seven the end number seven plus six is thirteen okay so again drop a ten and we have the last number is three okay so you have to put down the last number three here okay and just count all those dropping tens. lines okay so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so the answer will be 83 okay next we have 5 4 9 9 5 14 drop a 10 we have last number is 4 4 plus 7 11 drop a 10 1 1 8 9 9 6 15 drop a 10 5 is the end number 5 3 8 8 4 12 drop a 10 Two is the end number. Two plus five, seven. Seven two nine 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 eighteen. Drop a ten. We have eight. Eight nine. Seventeen. Drop a ten. We have seven. Seven eight. Fifteen. Okay. Drop a ten, and we have the last number is five. Okay. So you have to put down five here, and just count all the lines. One, two, three, four. Five six seven. So you have the answer is seventy five. Okay. Next we have the double digit addition. So this is the carry numbers. Okay. So the end number will be two and nine four. Ten eleven twelve thirteen. Thirteen will be increased by one. So this will be forty. Okay. 
two one three. This is the non-carry number, so it is easy, and the answer will be fifteen one fifty three. Okay, three four seven. This is also easy, and one one fifty seven. Okay, five seven. So this is the carry numbers. Okay, so that number will be two. And five, six, eleven, and eleven is increasing by one, so this will be one hundred twelve. Okay. Next we have seven five, seven five twelve, and two is the end number. So seven, eight, fifteen, and it will be increased by one, so this will be sixteen. Okay. So this is the double digit addition, and it is also by the Vilokanam Sutra. Okay. So let's take a triple digit addition. So let's take a triple digit addition. So I'm writing here the question: four, eight, five, nine, two, seven, seven, eight, two, plus four, nine, two. Okay, nine, two, five, six, seven, five. Seven eight zero nine two one. Okay, so let's see all those questions. Okay, so tell me what are the carry numbers and what are the non-carry numbers. So nine four is the carry number, two eight is the carry number, and seven five is also the carry number. So we will start from the right side. Nine four is eleven. Okay, uh, sorry, nine four is thirteen. Okay. Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So we will write here thirteen. But thirteen will be increased by one because this eight and two is also the carry number. So it will be increased by one. So this is fourteen. Now the end number is zero here. Two, eight, ten. Okay, end number is zero here. But sorry, two, eight, ten. So end number is zero here. And five, seven is also a carry number. And this will be. The end number of five seven will be two. Okay, but this zero is increasing by one because we have the carry number next. So this will be the answer. Let's check seven five twelve two. And the one is the carry eight two ten, and this will be eleven. So one is the carry again, and nine four thirteen, and this will be fourteen. So this is the answer. Okay. Next we will do the same method. Okay. So seven four eleven. So eleven will be increased by one because the next number eight and nine is the carry numbers. Okay, so th this will be twelve. Eight and nine, the end number will be for eight and nine, the end number will be seven. Okay, and this is, will not increase by one because we do not have the carry number next. Okay, so this is the answer. Next we have nine six. So nine six is fifteen, but it is not increasing by one because we do not have the carry number next. And seven two nine, but but this will be, but this nine will be. Seven two nine, this nine will be increased by one because we have the carry number next. So this will become ten, but we will take the end number. So this is zero, okay? And this is ten, so this is also a zero end number. End number, okay? So so yes, so this five. This fifteen is increased by one. Why? Because we have the carry number next now. Because this number is also a carry number next. Okay. So this will become sixteen hundred. Five five ten. Let's check conventionally. Five five ten is zero. Next we have the carry one nine seven plus three ten, and we have the carry one, and this will become sixteen. Okay. Next we have this number. So this will be increased by one because we do we have the carry number next. Okay, so nine seven sixteen. Okay, and sixteen will be increased by one. So we will write here seventeen and eight to ten, and we will write here the end number and zero plus one is one. Okay, so this is the answer. Now let's solve some questions of four digit number. Let's see how can we solve it. Four Eight, nine, two, 
seven two three four. So again, solve this addition by these methods. Okay, by the end numbers method. So we will see seven plus four, eight plus two, nine plus three. So these three are all the carry numbers. Okay. So seven plus four is eleven, but eleven will be increased by one. So this will become twelve. Eight plus two, ten. The end number is zero, but it will be increased by one. So this will become one. Nine three, twelve. Okay. So this is the end number is here two. And two four is six. Okay, so this is the answer, and this is how you can solve it. Let's check conventional. Four two six nine three twelve two two. Carry one. Eight two ten. Ten plus one is eleven, and eleven. Carry one here, and seven four. Seven four is eleven, and eleven plus one is twelve. Okay, so this is the correct. So, this is how you can solve the. All the additions, all the lengthy additions, by the end numbers method, okay, or by the Lokanam Sutra method, okay. So in the next video, we will see all those lengthy additions, okay, uh, like uh, uh, four digit additions or the five digit additions, six digit addition, okay. So we will practice all those addition in the in our next video, okay. So we will meet in our next class. So keep learning, keep watching, and thank you for joining the class. This is all for today. Okay. So thank you again.